What is going on, guys? This is Davis Warren again, back with, uh, I guess, really our first points race. Well, I guess it's not even really a points race quite yet, but this is our uh, uh, working on our first points race for uh, our AI career. And we are here at Daytona for uh, 2019 Daytona 500 qualifying. So getting ready to qualify here. What we're going to do in this video is do Daytona 500 qualifying, set the lineups for the duels, and then run the duels to set the field. So super uh, excited about this. Let's just get on with it here. Um, so we're going to do, it, it was one lap qualifying um, at this time, and it, it's still, I mean, it is to this day, it's it's one lap qualifying. So that's what we're going to do here. On a side note, we're, we are going to try to um, mimic the um, all the guys on our, sorry, we're going to mimic the, the qualifying formats from this, uh, from from each season, so we're going to you know, like we did with the restart rules in the 2009 season, we'll uh, we'll fall, we'll do the same thing with qualifying here, so it's going to be one lap qualifying, but then from uh, after Daytona Going all the way to whenever that was, maybe Talladega. Well, Talladega wouldn't have done it. So I think Dover was the first race where it went back to single car qualifying. But every race before that, we're gonna do group qualifying. It won't be necessarily um, like three rounds or anything, but we'll do like a a 10 minute session. I think that would be a good idea. That's at least the plan for right now. Um, but yeah, so let's see what this looks like here. You just, you did just see the four car is, uh, is his paint is not loading and I have a new, uh, idea for all these cars that, that aren't going to load their paints. Cause you know, with these being the same or with these, these being a different, um, different uh, AI set for each race we do it's not always going to load so with the with the 2009 set it was all the same scheme all the same set so we could bring them all you know I could download all those schemes and have them on the uh, computer to where you don't even have to really do a download it's just they're just already there and it's just all train paints has to do is just link them together but with this you have to download them usually there's about two that won't uh, be able to load most of the time. So what we're going to do is any scheme that they, any cars whose scheme doesn't load, we're going to send them to the back. Cause I really would like to not see them up front. <laughs> um, so yeah, they're just going to, they're going to fail tech and they'll be going to the back. So cool. Well, that's the one lap. The, that is in the books for everybody except for us. We need to get out there and qualify. Looks so. I, I need really. We really need to try to get into the front row, but really we. So we got six guys we need to try to beat here. So we got um, the 66 of Joey Gase, the 71 of um, Ryan Truex, the 31 of Tyler Reddick, the 62 of Brennan Gone, the 27 of Casey Mears, and the 96 of Parker Kligerman. So the top two guys we're gonna try to diagnose that real quick see who are the top two guys right now because the top two in qualifying from right here will be locked into this into the show so it looks like that is Tyler Reddick that's very that makes a lot of sense he'll he is now in and it looks like Ryan Truex is on the bubble right now so we got to try to beat him we need to get a at least a 47 6 so let's see what we can do here Do a little bit of that right there. And here we go. Doesn't really matter if we get a huge runoff because we're going to have to maneuver the, the apron. I actually did a little more work to the uh, to the setup here to try to be really fast. So 
so we'll see if we can uh, if that work will pay off. So we're already beating our all-time best lap. That's kind of not believable, but whatever. Because that's including laps that are like in the draft. Maybe it's compared to just qualifying. I don't know. I hope we can get on the front row here. We'll see. And you know what? We'll go for the apron. Why not? There's a flag. It's over. We are fifth. Okay, so we're not going to be on the pole, but we're on the front row. But we are now locked into the show. So that is very good news. So it'll be us and Tyler Reddick locked into the show. So now there are five, or yeah, five guys. Wait, is that right? Yeah, five guys competing for two spots. So we're gonna be sending three guys home from this race. This will actually be as a you know you know what's different between this and the the 2009 season is that we'll rarely send drivers home, send cars home. Uh, but this is one of the rare races that we will. So let's, uh, so that's good. Let's uh, skip on over to, well, I guess I'll mention that we'll be in duel number one. So let's go ahead and uh, jump on over to that race session now. All right, we are in the race session now for uh, the duel number one. Um, if you're new to how this uh, works, how I do this with the uh, with the duels is um, since AI doesn't have the ability to uh, edit lineups um, or doesn't even have heat racing, uh, what we have to do is we got to qualify for each race we do. So we'll we'll we reason the reason we do the Daytona 500 qualifying with the whole field is because. We, um, we we use that to determine who's going to be locked into the, the the 500 based on speed. So, which means me and Tyler Reddick will be uh, locked into the race. Um, but for so like for this first duel, we have to requalify. And then after the, the for the second duel, we got to requalify them too. And then even when we get to the Daytona 500, we'll have to requalify there. So the the, the lineup that we get from we, that we had from qualifying just now, we won't be able to exactly use for the duels. But what's kind of great about this is we can um, with. Uh, with using separate AI sets for every um, for every race we do, that means we it's will. That means that the lineup will stay the same. Like the speeds of each car uh, is going to stay the same for these kinds of races. So, Ooh. yeah. So again, like Cal Bush is the pole sitter for the for the Daytona 500, but. Um, he also just won the poll for this. Should be going now. Not sure what we're waiting on. So we qualified second. Um, we should be third. So we, you know, we're one spot ahead. I think that's fine. So yeah. All right. Let's. Do this thing. Might, 
might just keep it at a 10. It's all right. 15 laps, that's a quarter of 60. We've put in plenty of fuel to finish the race. Uh, we will be able to make this uh, without stopping. So it's it's 50% fuel. Um, so, you know, we won't have a stop for this particular race. Oh, well. <laughs> You know what? I'm going to need to... Sorry about the, this. Oh, gosh. What is the, the term? Um, to, like, minimize the countdown. Um, oh. It's not pace laps. It's a... Uh, oh, jeez. I'm drawing a blank. Dang it. I've done this so many times. Grid set, that's what it is. I had to think about that. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Good thing this is AI and not public. So, all right, so I got another minute to wait here. Um, so, yeah. We are locked into the show here. We're going to be. Um, we're going to be in the race. Tyler Reddick is in the race. Parker Kligerman is uh, also... Okay, so the guys racing to get in are myself, Parker Kligerman, Brendan Gaughan, and Joey Gase. That's the that's the four guys. So that's going to be us in the 70 car as well as the 96 of Parker Kligerman, the 62 of Brendan Gaughan, and the 66 of, of uh, Joey Gase. And then... In the, uh, the other duel, it's going to be, sorry, I just had some cereal. <laughs> um, in the other duel, it's going to uh, it's gonna be Tyler Reddick, who's going to be the guy locked in. And then it will be Ryan Truex. And then, oh, I'm drawing a blank. Who's the other guy? Um, I'm forgetting. It'll come to me. I uh, got Harvick's scheme to load here, so that's that's pretty cool. <laughs> um, so we won't, won't send them to the back or anything. It's really nice when all the schemes actually load. So yeah, the name of the game here is just gonna be just gonna stay up top. And I think we'll be able to do that. I know the leader is going to go very early here. Gosh, I'm just trying to think of who that last guy is. Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Okay, so the guys in the next duel are going to be Reddick, Truex, and oh yeah, Casey Mears. That's right. In the 27 car. So, all right. Let's see what we can do. Oh, of course. Freaking cheater. Only goes when I'm not going. Got one inside. Stay right there. Keep it on top. Wait, now I gotta push. Keep it on top. Dang, now I gotta push two of these guys. Two lead. 
Name of the game here again is just going to be stay up top because these this, these AI still don't know to just be in the fast lane. <laughs> there comes Jimmy Johnson. I think we're in the better spot right now. I say that though with middle three wide. I'd like to give him a really good shove. This sucks. This is awful. <laughs> Sorry, Alex, but I'm just going to have to lift here. Woo! Not like that one bit. Why did I come up here? Thinking about just letting these guys race a little bit. Alright, so three out of four of us racing our way in are, uh, are back here right now. Should I push Casey Mears? Oh, probably it's 52. is the leader right now when it comes to the uh, go go homers I think this is going to be the place to be right here yep definitely is right now we're about to get hung out some spots there. <laughs> Stay high. Still there. Okay. Oh my gosh, Cody Ware is going to lead this race. He's leading right now. I don't know if he'll lead the lap. Because of this right here. Oh, my. <laughs> Sorry, Cody. Or he... No, he got it. Okay, cool. Okay. It's our time to shine. Gucci's time to shine. <laughs> so our strategy here is going to be just to hold the top. And just block the lanes. Except we are slow. So no way. Oh! It's more speed in this thing. Go 
Gosh, if you lift, you lose. Go down here. Come on, Jimmy. Down here. No, Jimmy, no. Let's just stick here. Let's stay just right stay there. in this line. And get it moving. Like this right here. Here we go. You're up top, three wide. You got one inside. Still there. Here's the middle, three wide. You got one inside. Still there. Still there. Still there. Here's the middle, three wide. Five laps to go. Hold your line. Hold your line. Still there. Still there. Right there. It's going to be a transfer spot. Oh, I should have gone up top. I should have gone. It's too late now. There goes Brendan Gone. You could say he's gone. Come on, you got it. What's going on? I think I should have put more tape on this grill. It's kind of race. Ah, oh, yeah. Good still up there.
Hey, we got it. There we go. Hey, I want out. Get me out of this. Okay, not that it matters. But <laughs> All right. <sighs> that was tough. Look at that. Got the fireworks for us and everything. Well, what a way to start our career. I hadn't even won an actual race yet. Just this. <laughs> um, all right, so looks like that's going to... Cody Ware got 10th. That's great. Um, okay. Well, I, I don't know why I'm scrolling down here. because So we're the, the transfer. So that is going to mean that... Ryan Truex is locked in. The race is over. I don't think you guys want me doing this right now. We'll park it right here. I guess we can make, you know, if we win races, we'll park it, you know, for the, the TV interview. I don't know. I think that's fitting. How close was this finish? Thanks to this new camera pack, we can use the finish cam. So Hemrick led the white flag lap. We got a big run. Had to hold it. It's not a ton I could have done, <laughs> but we held on by that much. Jeez, man. Oops. Close. All right, cool. All right, so again, that means that with us racing our way in, that puts that locks the seventy-one into the show. So Ryan Truex, who actually did make this race in real life, is now in. So now, if is that the case? Yeah. Yeah, so we're going to be that car. So, yeah. So if, really, if, hold on a minute. Okay, so the 71, okay. Okay, so here's the scenario. So if the 31 or the 71 are the highest finishing duel, uh, fin uh, highest finisher among those two in the 27, in duel two, then that will actually lock Parker Kligerman into the race, who just finished this one. He was, he, he was in duel one. So that means Brennan Gone is out of the race and Joey Gase is out of the race. So, but, so that means the last spot is going to be really between the two guys that it could be are 
Casey Mears and Parker Clitterman. So if uh, if Reddick or Truex are the top finishers, it'll be Parker Clitterman. If it is Casey Mears, obviously it will be him. So, all right, well, let's skip on over to duel number two and make it happen. All right, we are back now in race uh, session for the second duel. Looks like Byron is on the pole here. Um, went, went ahead and waited to record until we uh, got the everything set up and ready to go for when it came to the, the, the timer countdown. I think we should be good to go. Yeah, about 10 seconds left. So, yeah, got uh, Byron, Domenedetto, Logano, Boyer, Stenhouse, top five. So the high, so the top highest guy right now among the Gorgo homers is Ryan Truex, but he is locked in. So, if that happens, um, that'll right now Parker Kligerman is in the race. The next guy is going to be Tyler Reddick. He's also already locked in. The, the both these guys are locked in on uh, their uh, speed from for I want to say <laughs> almost said Friday <laughs> from um, from qualifying. And then Casey Mears is kind of way down here in uh, in twentieth, so we'll just have to see what happens. Um, that's really going to be the the main factor. It doesn't really matter what happens here uh, outside of uh, um, Casey Mears being ahead of the the thirty one and the seventy one. So let's go ahead and watch these guys. Oh, they're already way down here. Loving this new camera pack. This is fantastic. Love that shot. That's so cool. All right, here we go. Duel number two. Let's see who can uh, make it happen. Oh, by the way, yes, we are scoring. We are we are uh, collecting points for these two duels three, here. Three, so three. we did just score ten points in our first duel. Let's see who gets it here. Comes Maddie D. In that Levine family racing Toyota. I'll try to keep his focus on the leader. Looks like it's Boyer out front, but Suarez trying to get the lead. S SHR 1-2 right now. Let's switch this to that. hard there's Ross Chastain up there if you don't know I'm a big Ross Chastain fan so I'm going to be rooting for him here Matt Tift he's going to lead a lap here comes Ross here and more importantly here comes uh, Casey Mears he's going to get hung up to dry right here but I mean make it a move must know that he needs to get in the show. Here comes Ross Chastain. New leader, baby. The 
I don't think he'll lead this lap. Nope. It'll be Mr. Hamlin. Maybe some foreshadowing there. Here comes Ryan Truex, though. And... <laughs> this is Casey Mears' worst nightmare. <laughs> so, by the way, I did notice this after I had uh, already put the, the set together. But yes, at 31 is um, not exactly accurate when it comes to the paint. It's... Um, does say Chris on there. There's a guy on the, on trading paints named Chris who likes to take some uh, some schemes and just kind of fudge his name into the sponsors. And I, it, honestly, it's hilarious. I, I love it. Um, but it's it's the only thing available for the, the 31 car, so we'll just have to stick with it. But anyway, Tyler Reddick just got Chris a lap led. Thankfully, we're only using that 31 car, I think, two times this year. So, should be okay. But anyway, here comes Stenhouse for the lead. I just realized that 8 car is not supposed to be in here. Um, okay. So, okay. A card's actually supposed to be in here, but not in that first duel. So we'll uh, we'll correct that. We'll we'll take him out of the if he I think he scored in the top ten. We'll just take him out of it for uh, for that race. I don't think it's going to matter too much. I'm not worried about it. But yeah, that's uh, that's on me. There's the right number of drivers in this field, so should be okay. Folks are on the leader, right? Come on. Well, I guess we're... I don't know. Matty D. Here comes Byron again. Now here comes Logano. Now here comes Reddick. <laughs> there goes Stenhouse. All right, Reddick's still the top guy. He's still in the transfer spot right now. We're in a good race too. Casey Mears is up there though. He's uh he's making his way. A lot of guys going to the top. All three of the children's cars, I just realized, are in this race. Look at that shot. Look at it. Truex now fall falling back to third among these uh, these guys. Third among the three. Casey Mears is not far from uh, from the thirty one. Coming up on six to go. This time by. Let's go through the field for a little bit. Oop, not to him. Okay, there's Casey Mears. Might be making a move here. Oh, except it's Ryan Truex now ahead of him, of course. <laughs>
Casey cannot get off that bottom. He definitely needs to. Come on, Casey. Come on, Casey, what are you doing? Free to go here. So there's a second pad breaking off here. Ooh, man. Two laps to go. Matty D out front. Matt Tipton second. Oh man. Oh man. There goes Truex. Here comes Casey Mears. Top line just broke up a little. Oh, but here they come again. Yep, there they go. Oh, my gosh. Oh, they just got by Matty D. Just got him in the sucker hole. All right. White flag. Clint Boyer's going to take it. Oh, my gosh. Casey Mears, the man on point that time by. Man, he's going to do it. He's going to defy the odds. Matty D back up front. He got the big run from Hamlin. Oh, here comes Truex. I'm going to put this here. Can Matty D hang on? Can Casey Mears hang on? I think Casey Mears is going to. Holy cow, what a run for him. Matty D's going to win the duel, and Mears is in the show. Holy cow. That's awesome. Way to go, Casey Mears. All right. Well, that'll set the, the field for the Daytona 500. All right. So that'll mean two cars going home are going to be Parker, or sorry, three cars going home are going to be Parker Kligerman, um, Brendan Gaughan, and Joey Gase. That'll be the, the three. So the, the guys making the show is going to be myself as well as Casey Mears, Tyler Reddick, and Ryan Truex. So... All right, well, guys, next up is the Daytona 500. It's the big show. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, I'm going to try to go win the thing. So thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.